Hello guys, welcome to the next episode of City Skylines with me, Biffa. Here we are, just driving into our city on the road. Let's just see what... Do you know I've not actually tried this. This is the great mod. This is the mod up here that I've got. The um, FPS camera mod configuration. I've changed my walking mod. My first person view mod. I can't remember what this one's called. Oh, we've been overtaken. Oh, suddenly we're in the city. There we go. And I've no idea how this works. When you click on the options here... You've got a city walkthrough mode. You click it and it seems to randomly send you around the city as different vehicles. So, it, look at that. This is great. Let's just see if it changes again. I love it. It's a shit. Wow, those buses are... Let, let me out. Nope, I'm going. Oh, there's a building on fire. Oh, now we're... Now we're randomly a person inside a house, I think. Look at all those trees lined up under there. I wonder what that is. Well, I think that might be... Let's, go. let's sit here. Let's stare at this wall for a second. And let's just see if it changes. Is there a way of telling who it can change to? City walkthrough, mode, stage duration. Let's drop that down. Let's drop it down a lot. Let's drop it down to 10. And hopefully that retends it. Allowed movement in vehicle citizen mode. Oh, that sounds interesting. Manual switching in walkthrough mode. Oh, how do you do that then? Oh, left click, look. And it takes me to someone else. Yep, close that. Close. Ah, uh, let's try that again. Okay, left click. Left click. We want to pick something else, somebody else. Hey, we're on a train. Look at this. Ah, oh, this is brilliant. Can I also click this here? Ah, oh, no, it moves me somewhere else. Let's find a train again. And we're back. Oh, okay. Now we have got the things. Ooh, oh, this just looks. This looks great, doesn't it? I love it. The mods. There's also a first person, an FPS mod, that someone's done. Whoa! Look at the wobble on that vehicle. He didn't even slow down for that, did he? This is brilliant. Yeah, we can have. You can actually walk around as people, and it's multiplayer as well, which was really good. Let's see if we can get ourselves a train. Where's he going? Oh, he's going up here. I want, to, I want somebody to find one of my really freaky roads that that I've got. Look at the view of the city there. Oh, look. This mod is fantastic. Okay. I will do my utmost to put the link of this in the description. If I forget, let me know. And I'll add it. The view of coming in the city suddenly makes it all seem much more real, doesn't it? There's a sound barrier. He's so noisy in front. Oh my goodness, I wish I'd turned down the game volume, but I don't want to stop anything now. This is brilliant. It really adds something to your city, doesn't it? I could just sit here and watch this all day, but we won't. Let's see if we can find a train. Oh, look at that. My kid's in the back of me going, Mummy, Daddy, look, a train! <laughs> What's this is a... Whoa! Oh, look at that! He was cut right up by that lorry. That was so unfair. <laughs> Let's see if we can find a train. Let's see if we can find a train. Oh, we're back here again. Okay. Oh. <clears throat> Gotta find a train. Come on. Is it actually what I'm clicking on that it's picking? Or let's have a look. No. Oh, you cut right in. Okay, I don't think we're going to find a train. If I find a train later, I'll come back and show you. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Let's escape. There we go. That is brilliant. Garbage is piling up. Right. <clears throat> Enough with the fun. Let's have a quick. Swig of water. Hold on a minute. That's better. Right. One thing you guys keep telling me, <clears throat> which I think you're you're sort of right, is water treatment plants. Here we go. Look. Purifies most of the sewage before it is pumped out. Yes, I forgot. It is, instead of this here, it purifies what's been pumped out, but it also cleans up pollution as well. Look, do you remember... A couple of episodes ago, this was absolutely chock-a-block, and it stayed like that. It was like that for ages, and it's cleaned it up. This over here, you're right, that shouldn't be right near to that, because our pollution is bad anyway. Um, so this needs to move. You're, you're right on that. Oh, get, 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 exit. There we go. So let's move that um, up. Now, let me think. Let me think. Yeah, I'm going to put this down here. We're going to move it. Over here, I can fit it in. That where it was before. Let's get as close as we can. It's like hooking up on that other pipe. 
Operation normally, is that all hooked up and everything? It is. Electricity, you'll get some of that anyway. So that will stop some of that. But this dam, this dam has to go. These things up here, they're not working correctly. This, These definitely have to move. In fact, sewage treatment, I have so much of it. Let's just delete that, delete that, and delete that, and, yep, delete that, and delete that. Wow, there's all pollution up here. So the water flow here is actually... It says there's no water flow. It, it sort of, it's just disappeared and sewage has now flowed everywhere. This dam is going to go. It's not going to work. Let's have a look. No. You can't actually move a dam, can you? No. It's going to go... Yes! And let's see what happens. Let's just turn those off for now. There we go. Let's see what happens with this water. Let's speed things up a bit. Hopefully... <laughs> Here we go. Oh my goodness, the poop. The poop is going to be coming down here. I'm hoping it's going to sort of get washed away before it um, get. Oh, the poop actually stays. It doesn't go with the water. Ah, uh, it's like this area is polluted rather than this water. Because if this was real life, whoop, what happened there? An auto save. If this was real life, all of this would wash that down, and this would get diluted with some of that, and it would disappear, wouldn't it? But. I'm hoping it's not going to flood anything. It shouldn't do. It should just go out here. So we'll come back and look at that. Why is there no electricity over there? Because they are suddenly going to be saying we've got no water available. What's been... Oh, it's getting its electricity from up there, was it? From here? Oh, it's weird. Let's connect that. Nope. Let's connect that to that. Hopefully that should do it. That should go through. And you're happy again. Good, okay. Plenty of drinking water. We can actually turn on another one of these. Let's just make sure we've got enough. What's that extra? Oh yeah, we didn't need that. That was connected to the water purifying doodicky, hickey wocky. <laughs> no idea what that word is. Yeah, it is spreading it out a bit. Okay, well we'll see how that goes. So... Got a few abandoned places here. They're still saying about goods and stuff, I bet. But over here, something we need to look at is these guys are complaining about waste. Which makes sense, because over here we had to put the landfill site in, didn't we? So, let's put... I don't think we need to put... How much does that cost? 160 a week? Yeah, we're going to put the cheapest one in. Whichever that is. Um, let's put him... There, I think. That will do. And he can go out and collect the trash. And these are still sort of stopping each other, aren't they? That See, that's weird. That one's okay. That one's a bit slow. Cargo 100 radio. Oh, hadn't seen that before. That's from the extra Cargo 100 radio 100. So it looks like it's got its maximum anyway, even though visually it's sort of slowing down. Cargo 100 radio 100. Yeah, so they're working fine. What does it say on these, then? Nothing. We get how many passengers. Okay, that's fair enough. Um, but why are these abandoned? Still the goods problem. Land value... See, they could be upgrading soon. Not enough goods to sell. Uh, we've still got that freaky road that isn't really there. Although it seems... Like it's not going. Before, it would go, wouldn't it? And now it's here. What is it that's causing that? That is a very weird glitch. Is it stopping anything from working? No, everything's moving. Okay, fair enough. No idea what we can do about that. Um, yeah, so we've got these guys here making the goods. And they should be being transported up here. I mean, these are saying... This is saying here that we would need more commercial. What I'd probably like to do is get a bit... Let's have a look around here. What have we got? So these are complaining about getting goods as well. The nearest... So we've got some commercial over here. What are these guys making? 
Midnight Blade companies. They're not happy about the pollution. Well, yeah, that's because the landfill site right next to it. That could probably do with being moved, to be honest. Um, a bit further away. Oh, how's the water going over here? Oh, there we go. Look, it's filled up. Yeah, the pollution is moving down. Oh, no. Oh, no. So hopefully that will just carry on through and disappear. Now, we have the flow going again. There we go. Looking at information and videos and things, something like this should be a perfect spot for a dam because it has high walls either side. You can build your dam up nice and high. It's got a good water flow. It's not going to stop. It's coming from off the map. Not like here where there is no input of water. This should be a perfect spot along here. So, I'm going to wait for all this to wash through first and see what happens with that. And just hope that we don't get everybody sick. Um, yes, yeah, so we shall see what happens with <laughs> Really hope not. We've had some great names suggested by you guys as well. This one down here, I'm going to pick the name by... Because this is like a peninsula, isn't it? So let's click on let's click on you. There we go. And this name was suggested by David Oakley. Thank you very much. And the name is Caps Lock On Bifinchula. Instead of Peninsula, Bifinchula. Yeah, you get it? Good, good. I quite like that. Uh, thank you, Chirpy, for getting in the way. Let's try that again. Bifin Bifinchula. Bifinchula. Yeah, there we go. And I like that name. That's really cool. Um, what have we got going on down here? Education, but we haven't really got... The only thing we've got city-wide is small business. Just wondering whether to do a heavy traffic ban down here. Although there doesn't seem to be... I bet he hasn't got enough goods. No goods to sell. See, I would... Maybe somebody can explain that to me. There's no traffic to speak of in this area. Look. So if people want to travel from up here... I mean, it's, these are busy roads, but there's no traffic. Look, you can see that. There's traffic here. Okay, let's have a look at this traffic. So to get into this section, you can come this way or this way. Ah, right, okay. So these guys here, the only way they can get... Because that's to come... Let's have a look. Yeah, that's to come into the city. So they're coming into the city there. Then they're coming round here. That's two way, isn't it? So these guys are all coming from here round. Okay, right, okay. So for this industry to get anywhere, it only comes through here. And this roundabout is the first thing it hits. So we need to split that up a bit. And then it starts spreading out from there. If we had another road on here... Look, in fact... I mean, we've got this roundabout here. Oh, they can go this way. Although this is a much longer route around. Here comes the pollution. Oh, man. As soon as that hits the drinking water, we're going to have to move. We haven't, don't own that tile, do we, up there? We can't. So the highest point we can get is here. Yeah, that pollution gets... It is. It's going to head in here, isn't it? Look at it. It's And it's not dissipating. It's spreading. I'll keep an eye on that. So they can go around this way, but it's a long way round. And if we hook up here, they may just end up going round that roundabout anyway. Because then that is... Let's have a look. This is the connection to over here. If they want to get up here... Again, to get to this section, they can go over. Yeah, so it's basically coming down here. Watching the water, watching the water. They go through that roundabout. So, I mean... Should we try connecting up a, a junction here and see how that goes? Let's, let's just try it and see. Why not? Let's connect that up. Okay, let's just do this road in two parts. Let's go like that. Space already occupied. Alright, oh, okay. And like that. 
Okay, let's see if that helps a bit. Just hopefully then they won't all head to this roundabout. They'll start heading down here and be spread out a bit, maybe. It's getting closer. What is our water? Uh, no, it's the pollution one we want to look at. Drinking water pollution 2%. See, once that's gone and been washed through, that'll be that, won't it? That was really stupid. But no poop things there. Yeah, we're going to move these guys. We're going to move them. Let's just pause. You are now being moved out of city limits. You're going to be moved up here. As far up as we can go. Water pipe not connected. Yep, you're going to tell me that every time, aren't you? Okay, let's move them up. Get as close as we can. And that'll be it then. They are going to stay up there. I'm not going to move them again. Because they are then going to be above... Above the flow, or the top of the flow, and any pollution's coming out at the bottom. Which is how it should be. I mean, the only reason it's ended up like this is because I was trying to get that... That darn dam going. That damn darn, the darn dam. And it wasn't working. So, there you go. We don't want anybody drinking poopy water. That is not good. So I'm hoping now... Whoa, yep, you placed. Good, good. Autosave. Seems to cause a bit of herky-jerkiness every... It's every set to every ten minutes. I might change that. Okay, they're all turned off anyway, so that's fine. And let's just get a water pipe over to these guys. Oh, we actually have one here, which is good. So let's connect you to you to you to you to you to you to you and to you. There we go. And they've got electricity. Bingo. That'll work. These are turned off. Yep, they're all full turned off, and that should be enough water. They're saying they need electricity. Oh, okay, no, there's not electricity coming there. My bad. That was water. Let's just run... There we go, let's just run that along there. Hope that kicks in. Yay! There we go. Water availability. Reasonable amounts. Okay, good, good. We could, in fact, just take one more of these. Just to give us a little bit extra. And he's connected already. Oh, and he's turned off. Turn on. Good. There we go. Now you poop water can wash away as much as you like. So let's see, has that made any difference? Are people using this road? They are using that road, good. Maybe we'll have to wait and see. It's just this spot here, isn't it? They all seem to be coming up and in. It's like this is the only connection to that fast road. Although we've got this one here, they seem to favourite this one. See, I'm wondering whether just to remove that road and expand that roundabout a bit, because that is a bit of a pain. We'll see how this goes. Now we've added this in, hopefully that will make a difference. Um, possibly. So how's everybody doing up here? Up here's okay. You're unhappy about something. Let's have a look. Citizens are sick. Oh, well, okay, well, we're fixing that. Oh, what's going on here? You're being blocked by this guy. Okay, well... You go ahead, do your jobs. Let's check out the traffic here. Not bad at all. Let's check out any red spots. That's busy, that's busy, but it's all moving. That's getting quite slow. Along here. Which way are you going? Oh man, imagine living here. So these are buses. Where are all those people going? Walking to work? So we've got buses coming through here for work. Let's just get the burn places demolished. Um, but it is moving though, even though it's slow. 
I think what I should have done here was have a main route in and out that doesn't have any industry on it. Because that always causes a problem when trucks stop and start. But something to keep in mind whenever we start again and do another map. That's a bit of traffic, but that's moving. It's moving, it's moving. As long as things are moving, that's the main thing. That's moving. That little roundabout's held up. This isn't, but we're going to see whether that road helps. What's going on here? That's busy, but that's moving. That is like the main route in for these guys. And that's always going to be a bit tricky there, but it's okay. That's moving as well. So traffic isn't too bad. A couple of choke points, but nothing that we can't deal with, which is good. Let's name one more area before we go. Where haven't we named? You've got Biff Terminal up here. Shouldn't that have one L instead of two? Yes. <laughs> and they're unhappy. Why are they unhappy? No, oh, I don't know. They're not going to be very happy there anyway. They're stuck in this eternal loop. Uh, where's my districts button? Before King Heights. That actually should be. No, we'll leave that. We'll leave that separate. Hermit Hills Park District. We haven't named this one yet, have we? Let's pick a good name. Let's have a look what we've got. Oh, we've got this one down here. Uh, oh, no, we've named that one, haven't we? Of course, we have Biffinchilla. So it's this one up here. Let's have a look. What have we got? Uh, I quite like, even though it probably wasn't for this area. He was thinking of another area. But Biff Hatton. Get away. Biff Hatton. There we go. Sort of like Manhattan, not quite. I do, how many city population? 32,000 in Biff Hatton. Average land value. You know, I should look at this more. No industry. Households, weekly tourists. Yes. Should keep an eye on those sort of things a bit more. We probably could do with some more parks here. I think we could do some more parks everywhere. You know, to try and raise the land value of places. Um, so that was Biff Hatton. Thank you for that. That was from Endfinium. So if you've got any names, what do we need? We need a name for here. So this is more industry, lots of commercial and offices, but we have our space elevator here with all the tourists and our transport tower and our wacky, freaky, glitched out, weird road that doesn't go anywhere or affect anything. So we need a name for that. And these are all named. You have Hermit Hills, Biff Forest, King Heights. That's what, not really anything there. This old industry area needs a name. Chronic Crossing can keep its name. And if in it else, at the moment, look at that. Good job I moved them. Woohoo! How's the water pollution doing now? 0% pollution on drinking water. Excellent. Well, there we go. Let me know if you've got any names that you'd like to have for those couple of areas. And next episode, we are going to get that dam working. And then we're going to work on some more of these these buildings here. We've got quite a few that we haven't placed. Uh, particularly these really top ones here. The Modern Art Museum, Theatre of Wonders. I want to pick some nice areas for them to go. Maybe we can make something that looks really nice over here and have them all. Have them all there. Because we've got the motorway here we can come off of. We've got a train line. Make it a real centre of places to visit. We might even put another airport down there as well. This one's for the passenger service last week, zero. This one seems to be in a rubbish spot for some reason, I don't know why. So there we go. Thanks guys and I will see you next time. Bye bye.